Hey, you guys. All right, I may have to go here in a minute. I don't know. We got bad thunder coming again. But I wanted to take this opportunity real quick and try to make a quick video. I'm going to try to, like, skim through this very quickly. And um, so the reason why um, this started is because these two popped up side by side. And I said, you know what, this is perfect timing because I'm going to go ahead and make this. Um, this is all about deception, you guys, and, um, I've had enough of it, so I'm gonna point it out, like a bunch of other people are doing, and I'm gonna add my two cents in, but what I did, I took a screenshot of, of this so-called, you know, celestial body, it's not no celestial body, <laughs> here's what it is, alright, quickly, and this is gonna be a crappy video, cause I'm gonna skim, I'm gonna go through this quick, but I want y'all to see something here. You see this round shape right here. You see how it's round? It freaking looks like an ice cream cone. I just noticed that. But anyway, all right, the round shape. And then over here, you see how it's got these two little two squared off things right here? All right, you can't see it because, you know, all this fuzzy stuff is on it. But these little square things are openings. And they actually go around the whole entire thing, okay? And so that's, you know, you can see it smaller over there. But, I mean, it just, it goes around the whole thing. And I don't know what these are called. I don't know the specific name of them. So I'm just going to call them uh, cloud machine thingamajigs, okay? Because I just don't know what to call them. But they're capable of quite a few different things. Um, and let me just say this, you know, first, this is some or all of what I'm about to say is going to sound far out there and crazy. And, you know, that's, I'll have to agree with you. It does. It sounds crazy and far out there and all that stuff. But if I had just 1% doubt on anything I'm about to say, I would not say it. I would not say it, you guys, because I don't like giving false information. Okay. I'm not, I'm not that type of person. But anyway, I've been filming this for well over three years now. I have documented this so many times in my own sky above my house. These same exact things. Same exact things. Except for they don't have all this down, you know, down on it. It's just, it's the round. But they, you know, they're always pretty much cloaked in the clouds. <clears throat> they're, they're either like all white or all light gray color. Or some of them are like almost see-through. And then while others are black on the bottom and white on the top, whereas other ones are all black. So they're all different. But they all have the openings in them right here. And the reason for that is, is because not only do these things make the clouds, there is no real cloud out there anymore, period. They're all fake. They're all man-made. But these things make them. And so... You know, the, what happens is the the clouds are, I call it smoke, because it looks like smoke bellowing out of it. You know, you know and it's like um, all these different color of clouds you're seeing these days. You know, the, the jet black clouds, the purple, the pink, white, orange, just about any color is there. And so not only can you see the smoke stuff looking stuff bellowing out, but you can see the dye stuff bellowing out. But here's another thing that's bellowing out of them. And this is going to sound really out there. But hey, it's, it is what it is. Alright, I want y'all to look right here. Y'all see all these little square shapes here. And all these little structures right here. And then up here, you see like, it's kind of round. It's got little spikes right there. And then you just, you see all these little shapes. Some of y'all may know what that is already. <clears throat> for anybody that's in the mold business, you're going to know what that is already. But for those that don't, that is fungus, you guys. And I kid you not, that is what that is. It is a mixture of different molds and slime molds. Slime molds, you guys. It is this, this fungus stuff, <clears throat> this pandemic that we're under. I mean, yes, it is in all of our foods, our personal... It's, they have put it in freaking everything. But it's not only there... It's in these also. The, the fungus is, I have, again, I have been filming this for well over three years. You can see it. These cloud machine thingamajigs are up there by the tons. And they're, I'm, I'm not talking about like there's five or ten or a hundred. No, I'm talking about way more than that. They're everywhere up there. And so... You know, they're, like I said, they're capable of making the clouds and also bellowing out all the fungus. You know, when y'all, 
for anybody that doubts that, you know, the, the, the you know what wouldn't do this, <clears throat> I don't know where your head has been for the, for a while because, um, anyway, I'm going to be cautious with what some stuff I say, but back to this, sorry, I distract myself, but, um, yeah, I mean, you can see how that's designed weird. I mean, that, that's just, and you can look, you can see the face too. All these things have faces like here's an eye, here's an eye, here's a nose and a mouth and they actually have multiple faces they have faces all around it it's i don't know i, I don't have all the answers you guys or i i have <laughs> i know how to explain it but i just don't want to waste too much time going into the face stuff but you can see here's another one the eye here the nose the mouth so yeah but you can see that that mold that sailor structure right there there's a bigger one right there but you see all that that's what that is that's all that stuff on the outside coated on the outside of that that's all fungus you guys that's what that is mm -hmm. so but these things are also capable um all the major weather going on the tornadoes the earthquakes the volcanoes the droughts the floods the the blizzards the extreme heat these are all responsible for it they're also responsible for mimicking the sun and the stars and the moon. Yeah, that's what these things do. They have lights on them also. You know, that bright white light up there. I don't never call it the sun because it's not the sun we're looking at anymore. The sun is up there, you guys. It's there. It's just being hidden. It's being hidden, and it's being hidden for a reason. Okay, there's a reason why they're doing it. And I don't fall for this global uh, warming crap. I don't. That's, no, no, mm-mm. There's more to this than that, and I'm not going to argue with anybody, but, um, that's, that's, I'm holding my word on that. It's not because of what, no, mm, mm Anyway, um, and I'm not claiming to be a scientist or an expert or nothing like that, but I've just been doing this long enough to know what I'm talking about. Anyway, um, these also are for mass surveillance, and so all these bug and bu uh, bird drone vi videos that I've been posting that I'm finding by the gazillions, they all work in conjunction with this. The bird and bug drones collect the data. They send the data to these, you know, whatever up there. And then they send it all from there. I don't know what all they do, you guys. So I'm not going to even pretend to know. But I explained it enough to where I guess you get the gist of it. Um, but also, let's see. Oh, and also uh, magnetic frequencies, you know, to torture people with. You know, like they've done in the past and they're doing it again. So, it's capable of doing that also. So, yeah, these things are capable of doing quite a few different things. So, there's that. Let me point out one more thing and then I'm going to go. Here's this one right here. All right. You see how this is about a fire. Yeah, this fire that broke out in this church, I guess. I haven't watched this video, but I saw this on the outside and thought, oh, here we go again. So, all right, up here, you can see how it's kind of got a round shape. This is the same thing as this right here. But you see also this black area? That's because it's connected to another one of these over there somewhere. They all work in conjunction together. And this right here is not real fire. That is not real fire. This is stuff that's a, coming out of this thing. And from this opening, like right here, it's coming down. And whatever material, or not materials, but ingredients, <laughs> ingredients, I don't know what to call it, you guys. Um, whatever chemicals or whatever they're using is, is, is what's creating this. Because again, that is not a real fire. I have filmed this myself up in the sky many, many times. It literally looks like there's fire up there in the sky. But it's not real fire, you guys. And neither is this. They're deceiving people. Many people are being deceived by all these fires everywhere. Uh-uh. No, people are reporting saying, I don't know what they're talking about. There's no freaking fire here where I live. And they're saying there's major fires here. You guys? Mmm. Okay. So anyway, I'm going to go on that note and, um, you know, I just wanted to make this real quick to point these things out because, uh, again, I know how crazy this sounds. I do, but I wouldn't say it if I didn't, if I didn't, it, like I I'm, let me back up. Eh. I would not say this if I had just 1% doubt, okay? I wouldn't. So I'm going to end it on that note and go, but I love y'all. Be safe. God bless and um, y'all take care. Bye.